Hello everyone, welcome to my unboxing of the exhibition book. This is from the Onu exhibition, so serendipity exhibition that took place in Korea. I think it also took place in Japan or is taking place in Japan. Um, but yeah, so I ordered this book, pre-ordered it, it's been a while, it finally came in. And uh, it's a pretty hefty book. It's pretty large, which I think I knew that going into it, but it just, I don't know. Now when it came in the mail, I was like, wow, that was that's huge. So this is a lot, uh, a lot more, like, I guess, like, I wasn't expecting it to be this huge. Like, I knew it was a large photo book, but this is definitely one of the larger books, and so I'm really not sure where I'm going to put it. I'm pretty sure the Wings concept book is bigger than this, but, um, yeah, so it's still pretty large. Why do my hands always look so weird on camera? I'm sorry. I don't understand. It bothers me. <laughs> um, but anyway... I'm going to unbox this and try my best to get it all on screen because this is quite a large book. I've got a new tripod, as I've mentioned in my current, really recent videos. I'm filming four tonight. I'm not sure exactly what order they're going to go up in, so I'm just saying it in all of them. It is Christmas morning. It's like midnight or like 12.30 or something. So yeah, um, I will go through this and try to get it all on this camera for you, but it's a very large beautiful book it's very well put together um i have barely even looked at it myself yet so i've not even usually i look at it before i unbox it on camera but i didn't have a chance to do that so we're just gonna go and go ahead and unbox so this is a set of live photos that were specific for this book, so it's a, one of each member that comes only with this book, I'm pretty sure. These weren't included in the other live photo sets that were at the exhibition, and I have some from the exhibition. I can't remember if I unboxed them or not, but I did get some, and I don't, I didn't see these photos, so I think they are unique to this box, uh, this book. And these are on photo paper, so they're like shiny, and it just, it's got like a photo paper name on the back of it, so you can tell it's just like a print of a photo instead of a photo card or like a postcard style. So there's those. I think, I think that's the only thing that comes with this book are these live photos and I think there's a sticker sheet like in the book that's not like just separate like those were so we'll see when we get to it yeah down there's the logo well sorry I was actually working on translating stuff in here so there's sticky notes I forgot to take out um this is a table of contents I'm not gonna read it because it's pretty long um and I don't want to bore you Please ignore my sticky notes. I don't want to take that one out because I'm still working on it. Um, please focus. There's like a little intro here. This one's called Beginning Draft of Space. It's like all the different spaces that they had at the exhibition. This says beginning mix up objects. I don't know what that means. <laughs> and this says beginning master the space. So this is like, I guess, what was put in to the space after. Uh, chapter 2 is the track, so it's got like their whole sort of tracing, um, what, what they've, I don't really, I don't really know what I'm trying to say, sorry. <laughs> tracing, like, you know, BTS Begins, Jolo, Mic Drop, Young Forever, Bangtan Room, Tear, We're On, so it's like going through a bunch of different songs and like areas that they went through in their career. This is BTS Begins, section one. There's different, like, little text here and there, but I'm not going to read it. I'm just going to read, like, the heading. So this is, like, going 
uh, with each section. It's got a name of songs and there's various different shoots for each each song or each era, things like that. And so these are like blow-ups of the shots that are in the exhibition, I guess. Mic drop. And so it's not just from the era, I guess, because these are from different award shows throughout. Like there's their first number one and these various like end of the year award shows. So it's sort of like tracing some of their awards. Young Forever. Sorry about that glare. There's so many pictures on these pages, I don't know if you're going to be able to see them very well. Probably not, so I apologize for that. This is Bangtan Room, is the name of this chapter, or the section of this chapter. So it's like, I think it's like items that used to be in like their studio or something, because it says the past. And it's got various, you know, like sort of artifacts, like this camera, like, I like guess this is Tang's camera. And that's one of um, Hoseok's little pouches, these little figures and games and clothes. So I guess it's just stuff that they put in the exhibition. Um, their items or whatever, I assume they're getting it back after the exhibition, but I don't know. I don't know exactly what that was for. This one says tear, and there's a bunch of like um, unaired practice videos. I wish they would. Oh my goodness, all of these videos. I wish they would air, <laughs> air some of these. This one's called We On. Spring Day. So these are photos that are. Mostly, or I was going to say it's mostly taken by the members, but I guess not because a lot of them say BTS crew. So that's the staff like taking photos behind the scenes. But some of them are taken by members like this is by, this one was taken by Namju and this one was taken by, taken by Jin. Um, that one was taken by Jin. This one was taken by Jimin. This one was taken by Jimin. I'm trying to like point out, I know you can't see that text because it's too tiny, so... I'll try and point out some of the photos that were taken. Jimin took that one. Jimin took this one. Um, Jungkook took that one. Taehyung took that one. Jimin, Jimin, Hoseok, Taehyung. And that's a crew photo. This is Namjoon. Uh, Jungkook took this one, and this one, and this one, and this one, <laughs> and this one. Let's see, um, that's it. Jimin took this one, Taehyung took this one, and Taehyung took that one. The other ones were crew photos. So this one is Jungkook, this one is Jungkook. Uh, these are crew photos. Oh, that was my ring hitting the tripod. Uh, Jungkook took that one. And Jimin, Taehyung, Jimin. And then we've got on here is Jungkook, Hoseok, Jimin, Yoongi, Jimin, and Jimin up here, Namjoon down here. So they, they're putting in a, you know, a lot of photos that they took themselves of other members, but there's a lot of like crew photos throughout as well. So let's see what we got here. Yoongi took this one, Jungkook took these two, Jimin, Yoongi. 
Jungkook took that one, Jungkook took this one, Seaman took this one and this one, and Jin took these two. So I think what, I'm sorry, these are like, I'm trying to like process. These ones are, um, I think these photos were the ones that were kind of on the wall. The, like the wall of the exhibition, I guess, had a bunch of different photos that were taken by members and some were taken by a crew. I remember that being like a description of the exhibition. So this must be just like digital print um, of those photos. Um, so that way fans who couldn't go to the exhibition could see the photos. And also you could have like a keepsake or whatever. So here, oh I just noticed that one. <laughs> I, guess, I guess they're not going to blur his face out there. Um, anyway, uh, Jungkook took that one, Jimin took that one, Hoseok took this one, Namjoon took that one, Yoongi took this one, and the rest are crew photos. This page, we've got Taeyong took that one, Hoseok took that one, Jin took this one, Jimin took this one, Jin, Jimin, the rest are crew photos. Not looking at these in super detail, I'll have to go back and look at it later. And on this page we've got Tin took this one, Hoseok took this one, and this one, and this one, and Yoongi took this one. These are the stickers, I think, yeah. So it's just like some of the prints they've turned into stickers on this one page here. And then here we've got two crew photos. This section's called Love Maze. So it looks like a bunch of mirror mazes, and they left messages throughout the mirror maze. Hoylian 52. House of Masks. And this is like showing the masks that they each had, I guess. These pages are cool. I saw these pages when I was sort of flipping through. So it's like, it's a photo, whatever, you know, photo of a member, but then it has this overlay where it's like drawn of the member and also the um, poem that they wrote in that one episode of Run. I forget the episode, but it's the episode where they all write a poem and they all read it out at the end. Um, but I can't remember what episode that is, but this is like the poem that they wrote and it's in their own handwriting on an overlay on the photos. So I thought that was really cool. I can't read their handwriting, unfortunately, because I'm terrible at reading handwriting. I mean, some of them I can. Most of them I can't, though. <laughs> so um, I'll have to... I think they uploaded the poems to the V app as well, like the writing their handwriting maybe i don't remember i feel like that was a thing but it may not have been and i couldn't read it i mean it's the same thing i couldn't read it on there either because i just can't read handwriting so i'll have to look for someone who's typed it up or i'll have to read the korean subtitles on the actual episode to be able to transcribe what they wrote I really wish I could <laughs> read handwriting. The section's called DNA. And so these are like, I guess these, these are like little questions that they answer and then like write an explanation. So I remember those being up in the exhibition as well. So they took the, all the writings that they did that were up in frames and just printed them in the book. It'll take me forever to read that. <laughs> If I rule the rule, if ugh, if I ruled the world, apologize. Had too much wine. <laughs> These are drawings that they did that were in the exhibition. It's like behind cut of them drawing. This section is called tomorrow. Oh, these are from the Butterfly Dreams exhibition. I remember those. Army Bomb. It's a section. Wings. It's like a bunch of shots from the Wings tour. 
Man, they really like milked that whole tour. For, I mean, I mean, I don't mean them. I mean like the company. <laughs> There's so many things that were produced. Not saying that's a, that's a bad thing, just that it's a lot. <laughs> and it's here too. But I mean, it makes sense that it's here because these, you know, this is something that they went through. Um, it was a big thing for them, of course. And there's Pitam Numur, is a section. I guess I took this photo later though, definitely because Tang's hair is longer and their hair is different colors, but they're wearing the same clothes. Moving frame video play. So this must have been the thing where they had like the little videos playing, I guess. And all these Polaroids that they took. The section is uh Tonaji Motan Jinshim, so truth untold. They have little writings over here. Idol. It's a section. So I guess these are um short interviews. I'm like really too tired to be reading it, so I'm just kinda skimming. I guess it's just small interviews that they had. Just more things for me to translate. <laughs> Hidden track, and it goes hidden track of the members, and it says tunnel, entrance, and exit, bridge, container box, moving posters, and wall text. Oh, so this is like the canvas that he drew for the video, and the piano that Yungi had, and that little thing from Fake Love. Okay, yeah, and the graffiti room, all the masks. Telephone booth, tunnel, entrance, and exit. Was that like the entrance and exit of the exhibition? I don't know. But it's like going through all their albums. Bridge container box. Moving posters. Wall text. Oh, so all the text that showed up on the walls and everything. And this says chapter 3 BTS, so it's poster and MD shoot making BTS in the exhibition and special thanks to. This is a special thanks to section. So it's like little thank you notes. And that's the end. So there we go. That is one monster of a book. As far as I'm aware, there was nothing like this released when they did the Butterfly Dream exhibition. That was in 2015, I think. Um, I could be wrong about that. I'm pretty sure it's 2015. Yeah, because it was near the end of the year, I think, um, that they did that. And I remember there being exhibition goods 
but I don't remember there being a book at the end of it like there was for this one, so I'm sure it was just um, something they thought of this time around. And I mean, the exhibitions are similar, but I do think that this exhibition, having not been to either of them, I think this one was much more like in depth and much larger, like on a much more grandiose scale, which makes sense. But yes, yeah, so I think that's why you know there was more merch this time around, and also this book that everybody could pre-order and have easier access to, <laughs> which is nice, because I think this is really great if um, you didn't get to go to the exhibition. I'm sure this gives you, you know, the major parts of it. So yeah, I think it's a great, a great book. I'm pretty sure you can still get it. I don't know for sure because I did pre-order it. Um, I think I got mine from K-Pop Mart instead of the official site this time. But yeah, um, I, there might still be these, these might still be available, I'm not sure. You might see this again in a future video if I start making other videos that are not just unboxings, which I mean that's the plan, but I don't know, I just want to talk about like photographs and sort of how goods are packaged and put together, sort of just this whole concept of this exhibition and the book and everything. I don't know, I just find it all really intriguing, so this might pop up again in another video, but we'll see. I still have one more video <laughs> I need to film. So yeah, I hope you have a great holiday season, whether or not you celebrate Christmas, whatever you celebrate, and I will be back soon.